Good morning, members and visitors of Peace Lutheran Church. My name is Sam Benjamin, and I'm going to be confirmed in a couple of months. And as part of the objectives to be confirmed, I get to share with you my faith story. I was baptized at a very early age, on May 9, 2004, at St. Andrew's Lutheran Church in Lincoln. I'm very appreciative that my mom and dad saw the importance of having me baptized and adopted into God's family when I was a baby. God has promised to be with me always, but one of the first times I could really tell was when my family moved to Waverly. We moved here from Lincoln, so it wasn't a long move, but it felt far away because I didn't know anyone in Waverly, and I was leaving behind a lot of friends in Lincoln. We moved during the summer, and I started to get used to our new community. When school started up, that was another big change, as it was a new school building and all new people. Even though it was all new for me, and a little bit scary at first, I knew that God was with me and helping me get used to my new surroundings. Another time that God was with me was during the process of my family finding peace as our new home church. After we moved to Waverly, we hadn't yet found a new church to call our home. While we lived in Lincoln, we attended a few different churches, but we never found one that we could call our home church. My parents hoped that in Waverly that would change for us. Fortunately, soon after we moved, Pastor Wheeler came and visited our house and introduced us to Peace Lutheran Church. A week or two later, we attended church service at Peace and the Mac. Both myself and my entire family really enjoyed it. We decided to become members and have been attending Peace every week since then. The third time that I knew God, knew God was with me was when I attended Camp Luther near Schuyler, the summer after my sixth grade year. I attended camp with several classmates from my midweek class and also with kids from other churches. I felt that God was near me during the activities that we participated in such as games, lessons, and Bible study. I especially felt God with me during a time called TOG, which stands for Talk Alone with God. During this time, we read the Bible and wrote in our journals what we had learned. We did this by ourselves, so that it was between me and God. The four years of midweek classes that I have taken have really helped me have a better understanding of the Bible and God. A memory verse that has stuck with me is Romans chapter 10, verse 11. It says, as scripture says, anyone who believes in him will never be put to shame. I like that verse because it tells me that if we believe in God, he will always be with us and help us through struggles. The part in the cate catechism that sticks out to me the most is the third commandment, which is remember the Sabbath day by keeping it holy. I chose this because God loved us so much that he set aside a day that we could worship him. During high school, I will continue to feed my faith by participating in events, by continuing to have personal time with God while reading the Bible, and I will continue to attend youth group activities. I also plan on serving at church in various roles, such as VBS. I enjoy VBS because it gives me a chance to teach younger kids about God. Knowing that God sent his son to be my savior tells me that he loves me very much and cares for me and others. Knowing this provides me the strength to live my life every day. Thank you. Let's pray. Lord, we thank and praise you for Sam. We thank you for the faith that you have imparted into him. We ask you to grow it as you grow him, as he continues to be a contributor in your kingdom, we ask you to continue to bless him and bless our congregation so that we are a blessing to him and his family. This we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Good job. Let's pray.